Now, I know it's Halloween season and some people like to get a little frisky, you know, like to like amp up the pranking a little bit, have some fun. But Fifi's been humiliated. Somebody went and put a little tutu and some ballerina slippers and what I can only presume is supposed to be a tiara on top of Fifi's head. Now I gotta admit, I mean, at least the quality is, is quite good. I don't know who did this, but they know how to make a tutu. This is a fine quality tutu right here. And these slippers, these slippers, I mean, I don't, I don't really expect Fifi to be balancing on his toes anytime soon. And the crown or tiara or whatever it is, you know, I was half expecting there to be a sign up here to, for, to, to let me know who did this shenanigans. So yeah, if you know who did this, leave me a comment. I'd like to make a repayment. Now, doing your best to ignore the gigantic Cyclops wearing a frilly tutu and sparkling tiara, Please notice the work I've done here. I've added quite a few more stalactites from the ceiling. And honestly, I really like them. I think they add quite a bit of depth in here. It gives you a sense of scale and how deep this cave actually is, which you really kind of needed. I mean, of course, it's still going to be a lot more added, probably twice as many stalactites. But what we got here is four key stalactites and stalagmites. This one, that one that one back there and this one are the connected ones and those are where i'm actually hiding the beacons and i think it works out pretty good but today i don't really want to focus on fifi's cave i want to talk first about the 119 announcements and then i want to get to a project that i've been meaning to do for quite some time and i think we're gonna hide it behind beat up's buildings in this little mountain back here so regarding minecraft 119 118 first and 119 many of you know at mincon live or whatever it is they call it these days uh they announced that the warden and the deep dark and skulk sensors and all that stuff uh couldn't pull it off they, they had a year to do it they couldn't pull it off so they had to push it back another six months and this of course has many of you asking the question well what about decked out 2.0 which i am still very much looking forward to doing i cannot wait i mean i have so many crazy plans for decked out 2.0 i just i want to get started on it but as you know it has to wait i need the warden i need the skulk sensors i need all the good things that are going to make decked out 2.0 be as amazing as it could possibly be so it has to wait at least six months Probably another six months after that when they delay it again. Yes, I am dripping with disappointment. Let's move on to today's project. Today, I've got a project that I'm actually real excited about. Something I've been wanting to do for a long time. We've got a big redstone project today. And it's something that I don't think anyone on the server has yet for whatever reason. And it's got to do with concrete. Because let's face it, who's got time for this super high-tech scientific way of, of making concrete? Buh. This is very boring. So today we're going to make a concrete factorization process. It's going to be huge. It's going to be completely custom because that's what I do. And it's going to be right around in here. So step number one is to make this kind of weird uh, concrete explodification chamber here with this beautiful purple rock that no one ever uses. The idea now, though, and what's going to make this farm different than other farms is we are going to actually be dropping concrete powder. Most of these farms work by converting the concrete powder into concrete, like immediately up at the top and then kind of pushing it around with pistons and then pushing like, a, you know, a, a row. I, I did one last season and I, and I thought it was pretty good, but it slowly pushes the concrete downward. Instead, this time what we're going to do is actually form like a, a hollow cube of concrete powder and then just drop it all down at the exact same time and what i personally think is pretty cool about this is the way this water is forming right now when the concrete falls it's going to kind of suspend in mid-air concrete falls from down there in a five by five pattern and it's going to fall right down along this water here when it hits this bump right there it's going to turn into from concrete powder into concrete and it's going to give us like a hollow five by five kind of little block here of concrete right exactly where we want it and then of course shortly thereafter the tnt will be plummeting down and it's just going to perfectly take out the whole little area with one pop and once the boom booms happen all the items will get pushed into this center block right there which of course we then have a hopper minecart down here that 
sucks up all the goodies and puts them in the gist. Now up top, the plan is pretty simple. We're gonna have a, a configuration of pistons like this so that when they extend, they all kind of touch in the middle. And it's on those extended piston heads right there that we're gonna store basically a cube or like a series of walls of this concrete powder. And we're gonna use some pistons and some clever tricks and everything to get it in this fashion, this format right here. And then, hopefully this works if i did this all correctly now when i pull this lever this should all drop down and it should form a perfect cube down there uh yeah that totally nailed it excellent okay and <laughs> and the idea now is that the uh the, the the tnt will basically go off like right there kaboom entire room destroyed Perfect. So I come out of my hidey hole and this guy just chops the whole forest down here. What's he doing? <laughs> Last time I make him a tree farm, right? And we got some more redstone done here. We got our four push locator things here that, that, that basically make the, the square of concrete powder that we're looking for. Now, this guy, that guy, and that guy are the same. That one's a little bit different because we'll, we'll get into that in a second. But basically all these are is, you know, as these piston heads are extended, the, the powder is coming down the line here. The second we get, you know, it'll all, like all five will be pushed at once and you'll get something like this. Bam. Okay, instantly just pushes it over and then it just starts pushing over here. Same thing over there. Oh, bam, it gets pushed over there and there and there and down. And we're gonna have like a little observer to detect when the cycle is done. But this one, as I said, is a little bit different. This is the loader where we're gonna be dumping in the, the powder. One of the one of the main goals I had with this is I wanted to be able to just load it super fast. I want to be able to just throw throw the concrete powder in there literally as fast as the game would let me. So that's what we have here with a little bit of science. I put a bar there and some stuff there. You basically come up here and go, eh, and just kind of mash your face in here. Look down at that corner of the block right there. You can just barely reach the bottom one and you can go, what? wait a minute, you can go, I might need to adjust this. What, why is this working? There it goes. Kind of, sort of. Let's try that again. This it isn't working as good as I had hoped. What? Come on. Please. Play, play more place. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, there you go. Uh, I have to change the height. I think I have to lower. I have to lower this. Uh, either I need to go with either a trap door or let me get some snow. What are these two hoodlums up to? Nothing good comes of this. Nothing. What is on Scar's head? It kind of looks like a laptop with seaweed hanging off the edge. I'm a little frightened. But yeah, uh, I wish they would have hey done Tango, that more slowly. Mm. Hey Tango, we're just recording a cool video. Oh, are you on the Hermit Crafts? Yeah, I'm on Hermit Craft. Oh, wow. Those are great videos. I like to watch those. Okay, goodbye. Yeah. For some reason, my texture pack apparently isn't working. But I don't know. Poor Scar just had a pumpkin on his head. Yeah, I tried snow. That didn't really work either. I'm a little bit concerned. We're going to stick with a slab for now. And I got a couple extra blocks there just to help me really identify where that corner is. But you got to be really precise with the with the pointy pointy thing. So I don't know. We may have to revisit this whole system, but we're going to move on for now. Well, I, I think we're done. I think we're actually done. We finished out the redstone here, and I think this thing is almost ready to use. Finished out the guts in the middle here. This is the timing system that controls, like, obviously, when the TNT, which will be in here, uh, when that lights, uh, there's a piston head that will extend that will hold the TNT for just the right amount of time so that we can control the, you know, the depth at which it explodes and everything. Uh, and then we got this little, little trick here we did with, uh, you can see all the piston heads are extended now, right? So we can push the concrete powder around the path there. Uh, and that torch, uh, going underneath there is what allows, this is kind of cool, I thought, I don't know, it's pretty simple, but uh, it allows the concrete powder to still fall through because the torch doesn't doesn't hurt it in midair, but it allows us to send a redstone signal through and then through the transparency of the piston there. It's all kind of cool stuff here, I don't know. Little, nice little compact set. Thought I was going to fall there. <laughs> it's a nice little compact system, and I think we're basically ready to go. So in theory, if I place a block there, it would signify the end, and we should see... Pistons drop this, that, and I think I want to see if that. I want to make sure. I don't want to. I want to put TNT in there until I know this is going to work here. So if I do this, okay, the TNT is lit, lit, lit. Drop, boom. I think that's good. 
I think that's good. Uh, so yeah, the only thing I need to do now is make it so that when it's in drop mode, in other words, when these things are retracted, it doesn't allow me to continue throwing concrete powder into there because it'd be bad. It would just fall right through. That's not a good thing. This concludes the redstone blabbering portion of the video. We thank you for your patience as Tango will now return to his normal moronic state of mind. Yeah, let's blow some up. Let's blow some up. Look at the TNT in here. Good. And this is the part now where I accidentally blow up the creation that I spent a long time making now. <sighs> in theory now, when I place a little skadoodler right there, should trigger all the bits and the TNT should fire and then I should drop and then I should blow up the thing and, and none of this should blow up. Reset. Go. TNT lit. No! Oh, oh, made me nervous. Oh, it didn't blow up the thing though. Why didn't you blow up? Maybe for whatever reason, it actually requires a full stack of, con of concrete down there. So let's uh let's load this thing up. Here we go. Let's just hit the thing. It's gonna go right there. I don't know why my voice sounds like this. And go. Oh, I don't like how sensitive that is. If I move it one pixel, it stops working. But it is fast. Look how fast I'm loading this thing up. Five at a time here. One, two, three, four, five, bam. One, two, three, four, five, bam. One, two, three, four, five, bam. Now you can see in the top right corner of my screen, it's looping around. Oh, hold on. And it's looping around and go. Drop it all. TNT, go and. Oh, that wasn't effective at all. Oh, okay. So it blew up the entire bottom part. Why, why are you still here? You should be explodificated. This is my public service announcement to you. Whenever you have a mildly complex redstone system and it doesn't work, 99.129% of the time, it's a redstone repeater doesn't have his dicks on the right. Well, hello there, Mr. Repeater. Thank you very much. Okay, we're loading it up again and it's going to work absolutely perfectly this time. Here it comes. Go. Uh oh, I got an extra bit in there. I think we're fine. Drop. <laughs> oh, we are happy. Perfection. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> holy cow. You got any cows? I need to milk something. Uh, ooh, sorry. No. But you got cows right there. Oh, okay. Okay, yes, yes, yes. I'll There's be, cows be right behind you. <laughs> yes. <laughs> you need cows? I need, I need cake. Cake is the answer to all my problems right now, I believe. One, cake is two, the answer three. to your problem. Yes, cake, cake. Okay. Cake is like seven sixteenth of a block or something, and I think that's exactly what I need. Oh, you're doing science. Science is happening. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. yeah well, I can hear it. I can hear. It. I'm sitting. Oh, I'm down oh. here. <laughs> I'm pretty close. I see. I, I see you popping into that hole up there. I'm pretty yeah, close. Yeah. And all, I, I'm just, all of a sudden, I just hear boom. <laughs> here, here are little boom up there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's some yes. science happening up there. I'll uh, I'll give you a little tour in just a little bit. We're almost done. Ooh, exciting. Yes. Okay. I can't wait to see it. Um. What's, what's going on here with the yellow? Is it uh, is this a new building trend, new color palette thing or something? Or? Yes, yes. You know what? <laughs> Usually, normally, I do this in like a test world. Uh-huh. But uh, I'm just doing it here. You're just letting which, it fly. Yeah, you're just letting it happen. Just I like that. let it fly. Yeah, it's working out okay. What By the way, um, did you did you see Fifi? Yeah, I did see Fifi. Yes. Yeah. <sighs> Yeah. Do you know did who you did, did that? Do you know I didn't do shit. I'm gonna put a tutu on my VV. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> who uh, did it? Do you know who did it? So for uh the through the grapevine, uh -huh. I'm, I'm hearing it's uh uh the the uh stress and gem and false uh team oh, combo. I gotta say, it's it, I will give them credit, it's clearly a, a good builder. 
because it's beautiful. Yeah, yeah, yeah it's, it's amazing. Beautiful. It's amazing. It's got yeah. like translucency and everything. If it was me, it would have just been like pink wool. And they got like glass and all kinds yeah. of shapes, and the slippers are amazing. Yeah, yeah. So clearly, yeah. it's someone talented. So you know what? Maybe 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 Fifi needs to suffer through it for a little bit. I don't. Know. <laughs> maybe just a little bit. I mean, during maybe. this time, Fifi not as intimidating, so all no. of our materials are at risk. This is true. But, this uh, is true. Yeah, not exactly yeah. protecting the fort. Yeah. No. So oh, they so got us. Okay. So what is Payback this? Payback soon then. What? This no. is just, I don't I don't know. I'm just doing like um like farm like visual farm like uh like I've got some wheat farms around you know. Oh, um, oh like actual grow crops is what you're saying. Grow crops. Yeah. Okay. All I right. kind of I mean this is this is weird but I like just that mundane like going through. And farming tend into the fields. From, from, yeah, I like it. Yeah, you like getting yeah, your hands from dirty. time to time. Yeah, I mean, you know, in a, in about a week, I'm probably just going to make an automatic farm. Exactly. Well, I mean, with but, that redstone uh, skill of yours, I don't understand how you could. Of course, yes, of course, of course, of course. Yeah. yeah. Oh, by the way, by the uh -huh. way, speaking of redstone skill, yeah. Look at what popped up in the B Dub's redstone shop. <gasps> <laughs> <laughs> yeah i got it. Oh, yeah the master me. has now become the grasshopper oh, excuse me while i go laugh oh, man, i mean this is good laugh yeah. <laughs> he's gonna be thrilled i'm gonna make the best thing i'm gonna revolutionize the game oh, i can't today. wait to see this this yeah. is gonna be quality entertainment i mean yeah good good wait that's gonna happen soon right Yes, it's happening oh, soon. It's going to be perfect. So good. All right. Yeah. This, this I got to see. This I got to see. Okay. <laughs> I got to go stand on some cake. Thank you. Okay. See ya. One cake coming up. I think that's the first cake I've made all season. Uh, all right. So here's the idea. Cakes, I believe, are 7 16th of a block. And I'm hoping. Eh, I'm hoping that makes the difference. Do I have some? Uh, I got, okay. I got a little bit of powder on me here. Let's see. Do that. Oh, wait, hold on, a little excited. Ah, it's not much better. Hold on, is it? I feel like there should be, I'm lower, right? My face is lower than, hold on, let me put the slab there. Am I, am I, am I crazy? It ain't any lower. Curse you, vile cake, for shattering my hopes and dreams. I tried snow before, but apparently I didn't try hard enough because snow layer four actually makes this much easier trust me it's easier it's not any easier dun, 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 dun. i lag a lot dun, 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 dun. i have so much lag hi oh hi oh i don't want to start hi you. i tried to whisper <laughs> oh my heavens oh my goodness okay hi hi, hi. how's it going there <laughs> I'm fine. Do you want to go see what all the boom booms are about? Yes, I do. All Desperately. Right. Fly up here. You've always got something. Some so, crazy so before, scheme. Uh-huh, uh-huh. And actually, this is good for us because there's something on this server that no one's selling. And I think we can profit. You're kidding me. Go ahead. Go inside okay. there. <laughs> it's a Listen, little let me just apologize. I'm yeah. sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry for killing you in last life. Oh, okay. okay, this is payback. I, I don't, that's another. That's another world. I don't even know what you're talking that's about. That's a don't total. Okay, 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 okay. Concrete. Oh, uh huh. Uh huh. Uh -huh. Yeah. Oh, baby. It's a concretificator. <sighs> so once it fills up. Yep. You're making you a go. belt. Yep. Just as it I falls. said. Oh. Okay. Kablooey. No. No. Yeah. So we can make concrete super fast now. Yeah. But I'm thinking this is we this open is up big. a shop and just kill it. Yes. Just kill yes. it. This is very big. This is big. No, ain't nobody selling this. Everybody needs concrete. So there you have it. The new custom concrete facator is complete. I'm pretty happy with the design. If you have any comments, as always, leave them in the, in the thing down below. And uh, if you got a good idea, maybe we can make some changes. But I think maybe. Maybe I'm going to start making every color of concrete into the sun. Maybe we open up a shop pretty soon. Maybe we get wealthy beyond our wildest dreams. And maybe I end the video right here.